I grew up over in Canton back in the 50s, and there was a guy there named Jimmy Haney. And Jimmy Haney used to come to our little grammar school, and he would sing this little song I'm going to do for you. It's called The Three Drunk Nights. It's a little novelty tune. It goes like this. Well, the other night this man came home drunk as he could be. Horse was in the stable where his horse ought to be. He cried out, Oh woman, explain this thing to me. What's a horse doing in the stable where my horse ought to be? She said, you fool, you drunken fool, now can't you plainly see? Ain't nothing but a milk cow your granny sent to me. Well, I've traveled this wide world over 10,000 miles or more. But a saddle on a milk cow I never did see before. Next night this man came home drunk as he could be. The coat was on the coat rack where his coat ought to be. He cried out, Oh woman, explain this thing to me. What's a coat doing on the coat rack where my coat ought to be? She said, you fool, you drunken fool, now can't you plainly see? Ain't nothing but a bed quilt your granny sent to me. Well, I've traveled this wide world over 10,000 miles or more. But pockets on a bed quilt I never did see before. Last night this man came home drunk as he could be. A head was on the pillar where his head ought to be. He cried out, Oh woman, explain this thing to me. What's my head doing on the pillar where my head ought to be? She said, you fool, you drunken fool, now can't you plainly see? Ain't nothing but a cabbage head your granny sent to me. Well, I've traveled this wide world over 10,000 miles or more. But a mustache on a cabbage head I never did see before. Thank you. Appreciate that. Laura was kind enough to, to mention my CD. Back in the early 80s, I did a record called The Ballad of Old Fort Mountain with banjo legend Raymond Fairchild and Arville Freeman, the Crow Brothers. So I said, you know, buddy, I'll do a record about every 30 years or so. So I went back to my files and pulled out a bunch of songs I'd written. There were about 15 of them that were about the mountains of North Carolina, like the Old Fort song, I got one about a snake handling preacher, got one about the Floods of 04, Bell Share, Beer City, Shindig, a bunch of different things. And uh, I'm selling them at the Mass General Store and also the Chamber of Commerce gift shop. Or you can check out my website, which is Richard Hurley, H-U-R-L-E-Y, richardhurleymusic.com. Anyway, going to do a little song here. Going to take a little poetic license with this introduction. But this is about a guy that hopped on a train down here at the old Biltmore train station. Most of you know where that is, down in Biltmore. When I was a kid, it was a running trains. But it's a song about a guy trying to get to a little town in Ohio called Morrow. And it's kind of a sing-along. So once you kind of get the gist of it, just jump in here and help me out. Well, it goes like this. Well, I started on a journey about a year ago to a little town called Morrow in the state of Ohio. Got it? All right, let's try it. Well, I started on a journey about a year ago to a little town called Morrow in the state of Ohio. I've never been much of a traveler and I really didn't know Morrow was the hardest place I ever tried to go. 
I went down to the station for my ticket and applied For tips regarding Morrow, not expecting to be guide Said I'm a friend that'd like to go tomorrow and return No later than tomorrow for I haven't time to burn Said he to me, now let me see if I have heard you right You'd like to go tomorrow and return tomorrow night you should have gone tomorrow, yesterday, and back today For the train that goes tomorrow is a mile upon its way If you had gone tomorrow, yesterday, now don't you see You could have gone tomorrow and returned today at three For the train today, tomorrow, if the schedule is right Today it goes tomorrow and returns tomorrow night Said I, my friend, it seems to me you're talking through your hat There is a town called Morrow on the line, now tell me that there is a deed, but take from me a quiet little tip To go from here tomorrow is a 14-hour trip The train today, tomorrow leaves today at 35 And half past ten tomorrow is the time it should arrive So if from here tomorrow is a 14-hour jump You go today, tomorrow, and get back the day you jump Well, I was so disappointed, I was mad enough to swear The train had gone tomorrow and left me standing there the man was right in telling me that I was a howling jay. I cannot go tomorrow, so I guess in town will stay. Thank you. Thank you.